Hey guys, Wild got a uh, showdown game for you guys against this guy. Uh, using this team right here because I, before I did the showdown I did yesterday with this team. If you haven't seen that showdown yet, for the explanation on this team, maybe you should go watch it. Hint, hint, nudge, nudge, but no. Uh, made the team and I was like, hey, let's quick get in one game before I actually go record. Just so I get, know a little bit about it before I actually start playing it. Because... I literally just went on showdown and made the team. I really didn't like go that all intensively in to make it. So yeah, but uh, yeah. So figured I'd just quick give it a test run, see how it goes. So yeah. Anyways, opponent's team, bunch of threats. Quite frankly, a bunch of threats. Like I see the Gyarados, I see the Talonflame, I see the Gengar. I mean, those three alone, they're gonna give me a hard fucking time because it's like I do have Rotom to check the uh, Gyarados. But then he's also got plenty of things to check my Rotom, so it's really just a matter of really playing around his team because it's just going to be a really annoying to do, especially with that Talonflame around. So main priority, get rid of Talonflame after that, figure it out. But uh, leads on his end, I thought he might just want to lead off with Rotom, so I was like, I'll just lead off my own Rotom, see where it gets me. So let's just get into this. So I'm going to decide to lead off with Rotom, like I said. He leads off with Talonflame, and this is the moment I realized, wait a fucking second. I'm weak to fire, and I'm neutral to flying now. Son of a bitch. But at the very least, I figured maybe he would do some weird moves, so I decided to just Volt Switch out into a Zoomerill. And since he did SD, I do get that free switch in, and I decided to just go straight for Aqua Jet. Even though Brave Bird would outspeed me priority-wise, that's just in case he goes for something weird. But he does just go right out to Ferrothorn, which is fine and dandy. I don't really care that much. I'll get over it. Whatever. By going to Rotom, now I can take basically anything from Ferrothorn. Which tries to leech seed first, which is the nice thing about Rotom Mo, but otherwise Rotom Mo isn't the best thing ever. But it's not bad by any means. But at the very least, I do get that uh, Will O Wisp off on him, so that's very nice. He does knock out my leftovers. Oh well. But here, I just went for Volt Switch because I might as well see if he's gonna try and switch out or not, or just get some initiative on the Ferrothorn or anything else. But he brings in Talonflame to die, which is awesome because that's just an annoying piece of shit out of the way right there. But anyways, he goes into Gyarados as I brought in Gengar, and it's like, okay, that's weird, but I'm just getting out to Rotom figure I can take anything. But then I forgot he can Mega Up, so that kind of sucks, because I'm going to lose my Rotom to two Earthquakes, which, yeah, now I know, uh, Gyarados, or er, Mega Gyarados checks Rotom pretty well this gen, so that's a thing. But anyways, take out the Gyarados close combat, so that's nice, but now he brings in Gengar, and I can't really do too much to it with my uh, Trachyon, obviously. So I'm going to have to switch out into Genesect, because that's really the best thing I have to unfortunately take a Shadow Ball. So, yeah, it's pretty sad, but I'm just going to have to live with it. So here, I'm just going to U-turn out with Genesect into a Zoomerill, hoping that would bait him out for some reason, but it doesn't, and he just... Yeah, so I just have to go into Zoomerill, try and kill with Aqua Jet. Unfortunately, miss a kill, which sucks, so I'm just going to have to go back into Genesect and revenge him with something. I decided to go for Flamethrower so that... He isn't baited to go into Ferrothorn, essentially, because I'd rather just keep that Ferrothorn out for as long as possible. So, yeah. So, he brings in the Togekiss. I'm like, well, I have the perfect check for Togekiss and Jirachi now, considering the fact that, well, it's a fairy type and I have Iron Head and I most likely outspeed it. So, fuck, that's awesome. But, unfortunately, he does bring in the Ferrothorn. I do have to switch out because I have nothing to hit it with with Jirachi. I do have the perfect check with being Genesect, so... I can just go into that. I figured he wouldn't want to stay in, so I just go for U-turn, figuring that would be the best play, but he actually stays in, which I found weird, and it's kind of annoying, but oh well. I decided to go in Gengar, because I had nothing else I really wanted to take something else, so I was like, Gengar, you should be able to do the job, I hope, and just go for Shadow Ball, and luckily that is able to take him out, so awesome! That's out of the way now. But now he's getting on to Rotom, I have no idea what this thing wants to do, so I'm just going to go for a Sludge Bomb to get some damage off, and see what he's kind of got going on, and... I know, uh, well, at first I see how it speed him, then I see the leftovers, I see how much Sludge Bomb did, and I'm gonna figure Trachyon should be able to take it down with close combat, so that's just what I'm gonna go for and take it out, so yay! Rotom's dead. Rotom is dead. And now he's, all he's got left to Togekiss, which, really no hope, I mean, if Trachyon misses Stone Edge, and then he kills me, then, you know, I'll have Jirachi to revenge him, but... Fortunately, I am able to hit the Stone Edge right here, which will kill him, obviously, because I'm a Life Orb Terrakion, and it's a Togekiss. I mean, it's not like Togekiss's defenses are bad, but it's just Terrakion. <laughs> but I'm able to take him out, and that'll make it be the match, so GG. Guy, it's a fun game. 
I do actually want to use Togekiss sometime, just because I do find it interesting with the fairy typing on it, but, uh, you know, we'll cross that road when we get there and see what happens in the future, but anyways, that'll be it for this. Actually, it really won't be, because I'll probably ramble on for a minute anyways, but hope you guys enjoyed. Um, yeah, I kind of want to build some other teams soon, but it's just a matter of figuring out what I really want to use, but hopefully I'll get something I want to use soon, so, uh, yeah, that'll be it for this, so hope you guys enjoyed, such, such, blah, for comment, sub, and later, guys.